Stroud playoff football from Brookings, South Dakota. Here we go in the quarterfinals. And with the wind blowing that direction, easy touchback. So it makes throwing and punting interesting. And there you see it right away. It doesn't get off the ground. And South Dakota State will have it for the first time at the 31. Now this was part strategy. That's Fonda Carl right there, number 96, the punter. They wanted to try and punt with a low trajectory to cut the wind. He cuts it too low, ends up hitting the up back right there, number 35. South Dakota State jumps on it. Outstanding field position going with the wind, starting off on the 31-yard line. A little flip underneath to Yankee, and that is stopped by Abraham flying up. And for the first points of the day, he does hook it in there. Without knowing what the other was going to say. Now that's run down to the backfield. Brendan Bell, one of the most energetic guys on this Villanova defense. Well, they're a linebacker-led defense. I think it's awfully, awfully difficult. A quick pop to Yankee, and that is destroyed in the backfield by Waxter. Some guys do it in the weight room. Watkins has done it mentally. And Jackson slips through there. And he's past that tackle for six. Jalen Jackson with the first points against the number one Jackrabbits. A little bit of trouble with the hold. And it's six instead of seven after Jackson races to the end zone. Impressive outing for Villanova offensively. But yeah, Villanova the lead with their first points of the day. And Davis is trimmed down in the backfield. Shane Hartzell on the next play. And the punt is blocked. And it's going the other way. Game flipped. Field flipped. Matthew Durant for a touchdown. There goes 45 yards the other way. That's the way to beat the winds. Block a punt. And race for 45, Matthew Durantz. And a low snap. Tumbles back to Watkins, who has an open Pringle to make the catch. To make this a one-point game. And he kept it straight. Inside two minutes, the clock does stop. To get the chain set. And after the 15-yard gain, a loss for Dronowski. And thrown again on second down. And complete to Hines, the tight end, has it punched out, and it's recovered by Villanova. Let's start off with, this is a really good throw. Hines pulls it in, and then look at the effort. Look at Brandon Bell. We talked about this being a linebacker-led football team on defense for Villanova, who's played lights out here this afternoon. And then Jalen Goodman on the dive to secure the ball. It's good things happen when you have a lot of hats around the football. On third and four, Watkins improvising and crawling his way back to the line of scrimmage. Quinton Hicks there at the feet of the quarterback again. And ESPN Deportes and on ABC, Jordan Love and the searching Packers off that win against the Chiefs take on the Giants. And a big play after the injury, Isaiah Davis breaking into the second level. That comes into the box. He's creeping up toward the line. And Gronowski over the middle to Yankee. Foot! Touchdown for the Jacks. After the attempt here, and you see, again, just zone read. Got the glance, a little slant route coming behind it. Second level window throw for Gronowski to Yonke, and they've tried to connect today. Pressure on Watkins, another screen. Barley converted on this earlier and does it again. They'll have it first and goal indefinitely in field goal range now, but they're thinking about a touchdown. There you have And movement up front. The flag doesn't come out. Jack's got back. And Barley is stuffed. Van Marl's in the backfield again. A missed a PAT earlier. This from 23. 
And it is good. It's like one. And Davis probing, and he breaks out. First big hitter of the day for Isaiah Davis. And he is gone. Line up. Pick your poison. If you are Villanova on defense, you're either going to load up the box or you're going to have an even box count. And South Dakota State's going to make you pay. And the coach has told us with Isaiah Davis, he's fat. First play of this drive for Watkins. And taking a shot into double coverage. And Beatum picks it off. What a college football player he was. And South Dakota State trying to milk the clock. And Davis still churning for another first down. <laughs> Getting close to a 27th straight win because of this guy, Isaiah Davis. Almost broken for a touchdown. He settles for a first down. But this, another day that belongs to the South Dakota State Jackrabbits. For the 27th game in a row, the Jackrabbits win it. And for the fourth year in a row, they're on to the semifinals, trying to repeat as national champions.